For today's video, we're going to be using a fire taser cartridge as a um, kind of display unit to kind of show you guys everything. So this is safe. It has been fired. It's no longer operational. So the first thing I want to show you, and this is what I consider to be the best way, and that is having one of these little pinky extensions. You can get this for the X26P and the X26. The X26P's version is not as good, and the cartridges have been known to fall out. However, it is still an option, and in my opinion, is one of the better ones, because you just pull it out and put it in. Super simple. It's right there on the taser. Very easy to use. The second option is probably the most well-known one and the most widespread used one. However, in my opinion, it's probably the worst one. This is made by Blackhawk. This is a taser cartridge holder. Firstly, this little hood thing sucks. It can come all the way out, and it's just bad. It's not a good design. Now, if you do use this, you can attach it to Molly, you can attach it directly to a belt, you can attach it to the front of your taser holster. You can get this plate that's kind of rare, and this allows you to attach it to the front. Maybe you got a pouch directly in front of it. You don't have room. You can attach it there. So this is still an option. It is relatively affordable, but it's horrible. The reason it's horrible is because it is next to impossible. Once you get your taser cartridge in there and clicked in and then close it, it is next to impossible to get this thing out. It's, it's just extremely difficult. It's very hard to get a hold of, and when you do, it takes a lot of force to get it out. It's just not a good option. And then you're fighting with the flap. The next three options are what I consider to be some of the best. This particular one is quite old. It's made by Blade Tech. You can see it's got a really old Blade Tech tech lock on it, and it has these flaps. So the way that this works is you just open the flap, and you drop your cartridge in it, and then close it. It does not have a lot of retention on the actual cartridge itself. The flap gives it all the retention and it is very easy to get out. Now the problem, as you've probably noticed, is it's doors facing up. It will not close doors facing down, no matter which way you orient it. However, it is still a pretty good option, but it's not what I consider to be the best, but it is most certainly better than the Blackhawk. If you do want to get one of these, they are still relatively easy to find. They are relatively affordable and you can get them in a single or a double. The second best option is this. It's made by Safariland. You can find them in different finishes with different snap colors. Um, simple Safariland belt slide design. It just snaps right open. It's got a good snap. And you just drop your cartridge in it and then close it. All you got to do is just get the snap out of the way. It's got a lot of room via these cutouts to get a hold of the cartridge, get it out, and get it in the taser. So this is one of the better options. These typically are going to run you about 30 bucks. So they are slightly more pricey, but you can get these in a single or a double. And Bianchi, which is essentially the same thing, makes a double as well. This particular one here is what I consider to be the best one. This has an old style Blade Tech Tech Lock on it. And this is an exoskeleton taser cartridge holder. These are pretty hard to find. And when you do find them, they are expensive. This particular one was $60. The reason I like them is you just quickly can snap these into place. They are secured very tightly. Cartridges are oriented down, so you just bring it out, put it in. Super simple, and it holds two in a vertical style. Now, these can also be mounted to the front of a holster, molly, or simply on your belt. As I said, though, these are quite pricey. So if you want to save a buck and find something that's still more relevant, I'd recommend going with the Safari Land one. Or if you want the one that I consider to be the best belt mounted, molly mounted, or holster mounted taser cartridge holder, you can go with the exoskeleton. However, I still believe that the one that comes in the pinky holder is probably the best because it's right there. It's on the taser. It's easy to go. But if you want more exoskeleton, Safari Land. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned how to better carry taser cartridges.